Hi guys, welcome to Embedded Vision 2019. My name is Liran and I'm Director of Product Marketing at Halo. Today I would like to show you the Halo 8. This is a deep learning processor that was developed in the past two years and actually a breakthrough in terms of the architecture for running deep learning on the edge devices. This single Halo 8 provides around 26 tera operation in the envelope of a power than less than 5 watts. Today I would like to show you uh, another demo, which is a semantic segmentation. Well, you probably saw some segmentation out there in the market, but the uniqueness in this product is that it runs segmentation, semantic segmentation, on a full HD a resolution. It means that you are able to detect objects from far distance and to do the free space and, and detect a, a, a cars from a far distance. Today, the current solutions are limited in terms of the processing. In order to obtain a, a real time, they have to reduce the resolution. So in fact, you are using a full HD with a high resolution uh, sensor. However, because of the processing power, you have to reduce uh, uh, the resolution and run it on a lower resolution. So this is a segmentation, a semantic segmentation. This is actually a video that we capture here outside of the venue, the embedded vision venue here in Santa Clara. We are showing here the semantic segmentation include two networks. The, the first one is actually the ResNet 18, which is the feature extractor. And then we have the FCN 16, which is the detector network. This is off the shelf network. Of course, we are able to take your own networks and deploy it, and you get out of the box better performance. In this case, as we mentioned, this is a full HD 20, 80, 20, uh, 1920 by uh, 820 uh, full HD. This is around uh, one, uh, one, uh, 11 uh, megabyte of parameter. The envelope of the power is around 1.1, uh, FPS is 21, and more important, as we always mention, is the tera operation per watt. This is around 2.6 tera operation per watt. Of course, this uh, Halo 8 comes with, with a complementary SDK, which enables you to convert your TensorFlow network checkpoint, checkpoint to a binary file that you can then execute on the device itself. We have offline uh, profiler and emulation that enables you to check the envelope of the FPS, power, latency, in offline before even you uh, engage with the hardware. For more information, please visit us at halo.ai and thank you very much.